sitting in the mock court for days trying to find the best dribble moves. I think I finally cracked it, bro. I think I finally really did it. And I'm going to be a good man, and I'm going to give you my six. Not only am I going to give you my six, I'm going to show you what six are good, what replacements I can use, even six for big guards, you know what I'm saying? So I'm going to get y'all boys right. I didn't beat Twitch streamers, YouTubers. I didn't win on 20 game win streaks back to back. I've been doing it all. I've been in the stage doing it all. I won't lie to y'all. And also, my six catch ankle breakers. I'm telling y'all this. Like I said, man, I feel like I got the best six. But before we get into it, man, I just hope that y'all could just like and subscribe to me, man. It really helps me a lot. Um, yeah, and just like and subscribe. I appreciate y'all, boys. All right, y'all. Let's get straight into the dribble styles. Now, listen. I'm going to show y'all a couple that y'all can use if y'all don't want to use certain ones. But pro dribble style is so good, bro. Like, it's a good it's a, it's a good dribble style for a, for a bigger guard that doesn't got a lot of requirements. So, if you a big guard and you can't use some of these, use pro dribble style, okay? So, pro dribble style is good. Kobe Bryant is uh it's decent, it's not the best. I will use pro over Kobe Bryant, but if you want to use it, you could try it out. The one that I use is Kyrie Irving. This is my main one that I use. I use in those clips because I'm a smaller guard and this one is a uh, faster speed boost. You know what I'm saying? I feel like a guard when I'm using this. Now go down a little bit more. Dame Liller is actually pretty decent. I would use a Dame Lillard on my guard. Um, like I said, you can need a 90 speed with ball though. So those are the people that has a higher speed with ball. And Gabby Williams is 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 the speed boost is kind of slow, but if you're a big guard, I think you can get away uh get away with it. It's not too bad, but it's not too fast. But let's get straight into the the signature size up that I use is Steve Francis. Steve Francis is the fastest signature size up in the game as of right now, and it's just fast, quick. I've been using it since 2K22, and I'm not like a left writer with the sig. You know, I'm saying I actually know how to dribble with the sig because it's a it's a good sig that you can combo up with. And the other one that I usually use like my backup is Darius Garland. Darius Garland is fire. If y'all already know, y'all put this on. If y'all been watching me since 22, I mean 23, and I know Darius Garland began the year was just it's perfect. And Kyrie Irving is not a bad sig. If y'all can get used to it, it's pretty decent. It's a good sig. Now for the big guards, I really don't know which y'all can use. I haven't really used the big guard sigs at all. So, but those three are the ones that I really use: it's Steve Francis, Darius Garland, and Kyrie Irving. Those are the, the best three in my opinion. Now regular breakdown combos. Now listen, this might take a minute because I got really take y'all down this alley real quick now listen all these that i got on are damn near good okay so pro fire lamello pretty good lonzo pretty good darren fox good darius garland darius garland is decent he get a little quick uh -uh. like if you got an 80 ball handling and you want to try that out please use that darius garland like you can catch a lot of people with this move because you see how you kind of flow with it he boom boom you can really you can catch people with that um james harden I really don't use James Harden like that. In one of my clips, I did use James Harden, but like I said, if you a if you a, I say if you a slow paced dribbler, but for big guards, put on James Harden because out of your combos, you could just hit a James Harden and then the speed boost right out of it and take the easy two or do whatever you want to do out of there. Now, Scoot, I was using Scoot. Scoot is fire. Uh, like I said, if you have a low ball handling, put on Scoot. Scoot is it, it makes you dribble fast. People don't know where you're about to go, and you can just speed boost out of it. Now, me, I use LeBron James for that little step back right there, so it can, you know what I'm saying? Uh, after I'm doing my moves, I can do a little a little tween step back, and I can speed boost. Whatever I need to do, I can combo out what I, what I need to do. It's a good move. You know what I'm saying? So, if y'all want to put on LeBron, put on LeBron. LeBron is not bad. And definitely, you only need a 70 ball handling, and you only got to be 6'10 six, uh, six, or below. That is, you know what I'm saying? This is a good one. I'll, if I was a big, a big guard, I'd put on that. Michael Jordan, I really don't use Michael Jordan. It's not that good to me. Um, Derrick Rose wasn't good to me. Isaiah Thompson is cool, it's decent, it's not the best. And Trey Young's is okay, it's not the best. But those are the ones. Make sure I get one of those on. Let's get straight. Now, aggressive breakdown combos. Now, listen, we got a lot of them in here. I'm gonna just skip to the one that I really use though. I use Trey Young, that's the one because it's like after I'm doing my combos, I could just like it like floats, it like floats into them, but it's like no contest. It's weird. It's weird. If y'all got a, if y'all got a high a, ball, a high ball handling, y'all y'all can get this. Try that out. See so I can uh, so I can so I can see what I'm talking about. Now John Wall, John Wall's is fire. D'Angelo Russell's. I really didn't like D'Angelo Russell because I actually thought like you know, as I'm dribbling, he's just gonna do a jump out of nowhere, but it's like a, it's like a pause to it. I really didn't like that. Um, Stephen Curry's. I really didn't like Stephen Curry's at all. Oh yeah, Paul George. No, Paul George. If you're a big guard, put on Paul George. I was using this for a moment. Um, I think about like three days ago, I was using it for like one whole day. And this move, this I'm about to, put, I, I might put, I will, I will put this back on. Like it's like, 
it's really good because like the tween tween you can speed boost out of any direction and it's like good with the combos it don't mess up your dribbling so that uh, paul george is one of the ones um scoot is decent Kyrie is decent and dame willer is decent and uh jamal murray is actually pretty good jamal murray is pretty good i was using that too and terry rosier i really didn't like terry rosier at all but those are the ones right there. Let's get straight to the next one. Now, escape move. Now, we're going to go through all these escape moves. Bro, escape moves are so good this year. It doesn't make any sense. Now, the one that I use, I use Jimmy Butler. Like, just look at this little, uh, you know what I'm saying? It's just so smooth. It's just smooth. Like, you could just combo and just hit something out of there. It's so smooth. It creates a lot of space. Trust me. I use this. This is my main escape. Jimmy Butler is really nice. And you only got to be, all you need is a 70 ball handling and you got to be a higher under 6'10". I'm going to make me a big guard, bro. Not getting all the cigs. What the hell? But Darren Fox, pretty good too. If you're a ball, if you're a high ball handler, use Darren Fox, bro. And you only need, if you have a, I don't think you can even get a 91 ball handling with 6'10". I'm not for sure. But Darren Fox is really good. Darius Garland. Ah, I didn't like Darius Garland. I'll be honest. I didn't like it at all. Um, James Harden. James Harden, I didn't like James Harden at all either. Like I really didn't, I really didn't care for it. Like it's not that, it's not bad. All you need is an Eddie Ball handling. You can get it with anything with Eddie Ball handling. It's not bad. You probably can move with this if you know what I'm saying. We two different dribblers. You could probably use this, but I really didn't like to use it in my opinion because I could use Jimmy Butler and other ones. Um, Kyrie Irving was pretty good. Kyrie Irving was good. I was using it at one moment. It's just this one move he do is like, he do is like this little move when he like push the ball. And like it gave me, it got a whole bunch of bump steals. You know what I'm saying? I was like, geez, I have to take that off. Right? That move right there, I had to take it off because of that. Dame Lillard has always been good. Y'all know Dame Lillard from 2K23 last year. Dame Lillard is good. Kemba Walker is always good. And Trey Young is always good. So, and you don't even need the 86 ball handler to get Kemba Walker. Like, you know what I'm saying? So, y'all can get some of these good ones, bro. Escape moves. So, go ahead and put some of these in y'all back. Now, combo moves. Gotta be real smooth with this, okay? Combo moves, Lamelo balls is fire. You can Lamelo ball like how can I explain this? Lamelo balls, I was catching people off guard with Lamelo. Like it was like something like you wouldn't think of. Like why are you even doing that move? Cause it looked weird, but like you do it, boom, boom, it's kind of slow. And you can speed boost out of it. Something Lamelo ball is pretty good. And all you need is an 86 ball handling. Steph Curry, fire, fire. If you're a small guard, you got 92 ball handling. Just put on Steph Curry so you can catch ankles. Boom, boom. I feel like the Jamal Crawford, but I use Darren Fox. Darren Fox, you already know. All I got is an 80 ball, ball, but I'm about to make me a big guard. I didn't even know you had to be 6'10 and below. Darren Fox is, uh, uh, it's just so quick. It's basically Steph Curry. Steph Curry is a little bit more aggressive, but I like Darren Fox a little bit because it's, you know what I'm saying? It don't take you all the way. Like, it don't take you too far distance. So that one is good. And then Tim Hardaway, come on, man. Y'all already know. Tim Hardaway is this one is nasty. This one is nasty. I called it. I ain't gonna lie. I'm gonna be honest. If you know how to do combo moves, you gotta do combo moves. I caught a ankle the producer. doing his little combo move. I promise you. All I did was that, and he almost fell on the ground. I wish I had clipped it, bro, but I wasn't even recording at the time, bro. But Tim Hardaway is pretty good. Kyrie Irving, good. Kyrie Irving just gotta, he just gotta, this don't go nowhere. It doesn't go nowhere at all. It's just a bam bam. Um, Dame Lillard, I didn't like Dame Lillard. To be honest, Dame Lillard was not good at all. If you can just put on anything else but Dame Lillard, that one is not good. If y'all hear me sniffling, bro, I'm kind of under the, you know what I'm saying? I don't feel really good right now, you know what I'm saying? So my fault, y'all. But crossovers. All, I really don't use crossovers because I don't really be like, I don't know. It's like, you can just pick a crossover. I use James Harden, but Chris Paul is pretty good. Like, I just use these two crossovers. I don't even use these when I go to rec, bro, because I play 5v5 sometimes, so... Crossovers, I pick who, which I want to pick. I really don't got nothing. Now, for the behind the backs, let's mellow off rip. You only got to be sick. No, there's no way. There's actually no way. Like, I'm actually just realizing this as I'm recording this that I might have to make a big guard. Because the mellow ball, this right here catches people. You go one way, you can, ah, uh, fast. What? You only need a 70 ball? I you Because I use Jimmy Butler, bro. And this right here is so smooth, bro, because you can create so much space. You know what I'm saying? Jimmy Butler is one of my favorite ones. It's just a step back, and then you get so much space, and you can just shoot out of it. Nothing happens. Ste uh, Steph Curry. Steph Curry, you already know Curry Slide. I had Curry Slide on. I beat. Uh, I think I beat Clutch with Curry Slide. Curry Slide is good, bro. I can go ahead and put that on. That's not bad. You know what I'm saying? James Harden. James Harden is fire. All you need is an eight, bro. I'm about to make a big guard. 
I hope that's my that's my last time saying it. I'm about to go make one because you all you need is a this little ball man with. Well, who the cops? Sorry about that, y'all. The cops are oh, they still outside? It don't matter. Uh, Kyrie Irving. I didn't really like Kyrie Irving, even though it looked good. I really didn't. I really didn't care for it. And Chris Paul, it was just cool. It's just it's just a it's just a calm step. You know what I'm saying? It's a calm little little escape to get out get out some pressure. It's not that really crazy, but let's get straight into the next. The only spin I use is Steve Nash, but I've been using this spin for like all my whole 2K. <laughs> like everybody know what this spin is. This spin will give you the like the little momentum spin. I've been just using this for too long. But that's the only spin. Now for hesitations, pro hesitation is fire. Kevin Durant is fire. James Harden is fire. You gotta find what you like because some of them might be too slow, some might be too fast. But I use pro in my opinion because it creates more space. But Kevin Durant, oh my lord. All you need is an 80 ball. All you need is a set pro. Oh my lord. I'm about to go make a build right after this. Cause I gotta see some stuff. Cause this is getting out of this is getting out of pocket. I get all the sigs. But yeah, these these are the three that I got in my bag. Y'all go, go ahead and put that in your bag. You know what I'm saying? But that is, these are the ones. All right, y'all. So make sure I get y'all hesitation. Hesitations can create y'all so much space. Learn how to do hezies, y'all. Learn how to use these effectively. Cause this really. Now for step backs, I'm gonna just go ahead and get straight to the cheese. Jimmy Butler, I use Jimmy Butler step back. Uh, Jimmy Butler is my favorite step back because you know, so I can do that little step back off my, off my momentum. Steph Curry's is cold because I heard he get a lot of like the, he got he got a good like step back. He get he get a lot of good animations, you know, since they're crazy. But you need only 92 ball handling. James Harden, uh, James Harden was cool. It's not all that, you know. What I'm saying if you could, try, if you want to try it out, you could try it out. It's not all that, but it's it's good. But the ones I got in here, y'all, like y'all can use these because these are not bad. Like these are good ones. But like, I'm just telling y'all what's better than what the other ones is. But like Zach Levine, Zach Levine's was decent. It wasn't all that. I wouldn't put this one on for real. For real. Kawhi Leonard, I wouldn't put this one on either for real. Unless you want, unless you like his his snatch, but his snatch is fire nice though, because he just do a between like that. You know what I'm saying? You don't jump a lot, so you can do the tween and just run instead of just doing the little snatch and you jumping back. Chris Paul, her Chris Paul is the best one, and you only need a 75. Oh my lord, Chris Paul is the best one to me. Chris Paul gets you a lot of animation. You got big step back. You got a lot of things. Jason Tatum was, uh, it was cool. I really didn't, I wasn't rocking with it, bro. I just got it because of just the little pull, the little pullback step back. But I really, you know what I'm I really wasn't rocking with it. All right, y'all, that's pretty much it for the video. That's all my sigs right there. I am going to be dropping a new jump shot for y'all. But like I said, if y'all need anything, like, if y'all need help, like what? Like, the dribbling, y'all could just hit me up on PlayStation at Sickies. And make sure you have a good day, man. I'm out. Peace.